The most important thing to understand when it comes to your sleep apnea diagnosis is really what is an apnea event. Now an apnea event is when your airways close while you sleep at night, typically due to muscle relaxation of the airway muscles, and you stop breathing for 10 seconds or longer. All right? You also have to have a drop of at least 3% oxygen in some cases, and few tests will actually measure that based off of a 4% drop in oxygen after that 10 seconds. All right. Now, anytime you have one of those events, that's going to be, going to be categorized as an apnea event. Now, your AHI is the number that your diagnosis is really going to be based off of. And what that number is, it's essentially how many times you're having one of these apnea events on a per hour basis. So if your AHI is 12, that means you're averaging 12 apnea events per hour while you're sleeping. Now it's also put into a range, and that's how they diagnose the severity of your sleep apnea. So if you're having zero to five events per hour, that's gonna put you in the normal range. Anything between five to 15 events per hour is gonna be considered mild. 15 to 30 events per hour is gonna be considered moderate and anything over 30 is gonna be considered severe. Now, we do have cases that get up into the 100s per hour, and although there is a big difference between 31 and 120, those are still gonna both be considered severe. All right, so a pretty wide range that you can land on there.